Yoo-hoo, Mr. Tentacle Guy. It's about time. Yoo-hoo, Mr. Tentacle Guy. What? Ooh, I don't feel so good. Again? Hello, I'm a tentacle. I'd like to enter my insignificant human in the show. Oh my, yes, yes, of course. Take these tags and put them on your human and have them wait on the bench in the lobby. Entrance will be judged in three categories. Best smile, best hair, and best laugh. Thank you, fellow tentacle. Unlike humans, you have been very useful. Oh, uh, thank you. Believe me, it was my pleasure. Now all I need is a human. Yowza! That was one good-looking tentacle. Say, cutie, what brings a hot tentacle babe like you to a dump like this? I'm, uh, here to see you, big boy. Really? Well, what are you doing for dinner? How about Club Tentacle? Ah, uh, what am I saying? I can't afford to take out the trash, let alone a classy babe like you. <sighs> I'm looking for a pet. Sorry, honey. You came to the wrong place. These three are problem humans. Untrainable, disobedient, downright surly. He's just jealous because we've got opposable thumbs. Someday you will accept tentacles as your masters. Huh, you losers can't even ride tricycles. You see why no one wants him as pets? I'm here by accident. Bye. Hey, I don't want to be here either. They may be oppressive and power mad, but at least the tentacles recycle stuff. Ooh, cute! It shrunk to doll size. <laughs> Stupid tentacle. It's a dented old can. There's a plaque here about it. In commemoration of the Constitutional Convention, interred by Thomas Jefferson, A.D. 1790. Run over by a plow, A.D. 1795. Sorry about the dents.
Looks like there's some kind of rodent down there. What an interesting mannequin! Great Scott! You're purple! Uh, um... Yes? I couldn't help noticing you ranting. Not ranting, plotting. So, what are you plotting? I'm building a shrinking ray, which I can use to shrink those pesky humans out of my sight for good. Tell me more about this shrinking ray of yours. I call it the Diminuator. The biggest problem left is to design a trigger that doesn't require fingers. Say, you look kind of familiar. Of course I do, Nitwit. I'm Purple Tentacle, renowned world conqueror. Are you the same Purple Tentacle who knew Dr. Fred? Up on your ancient history, are you? Yes, I remember that insignificant insect. Just exactly how well did you know Dr. Fred? What's that supposed to mean? You're not a human sympathizer, are you? Why, yes. I'm a firm believer in human rights. <laughs> I'd almost think you were serious. If you will excuse me, I've got something in the oven. Anyone I know, eh? Did a little pick me up? <laughs> Must open safe. Must sign contract. Must provide for family. Well, you know what they say. If you want to save the world, you gotta push a few old ladies down the stairs.
Dr. Fred Edison, Internal Revenue, come with us. We'd like to go over some of your records with you. Upstairs. Dr. Fred Edison Internal Revenue Come with us Let's see, it's 101 999 